Hello guys, today I am giving you a review of Beam. If you don't know what Beam is, Beam is basically like Snapchat, but it's a bit different. I'm going to be going over the differences for you guys today. If you don't know already, I'm doing a Beam giveaway. There is currently six days left to enter. All you need to do to enter is just add me on Snapchat. The snap code will be on screen now, or you can add me manually by username IKNYT. Yeah, the YT stands for YouTube. And if you just send me a message on Snapchat, I will send you a Beam Unlock code because you can only get into Beam by getting an unlock code. It's kind of weird. But it's just because they want to limit the users on it at a time. Well, that was their main goal. But it didn't really happen. Okay, so you're probably thinking how you post to Beam. Beam actually uses your proximity sensor. Doesn't show up on my black iPhone. But I'm going to have a picture on the screen now of it on a white iPhone. So you can see what it looks like. Basically, it's next to the camera or next to the microphone. And you just put your hand over that top black bevel on the top of your screen. And it will start recording video. So I'm just going to go over this for you guys now. So you can see it's recording. And the screen goes off. And then it beeps again when it has finished recording. It automatically posts, and you saw the, the screen goes black. The screen goes black because the maker of the app, Casey Neistat, doesn't really want you to stare at your phone all of the time. He wants you to hold your phone mainly to your chest and record video that way, or you can find more different uses to block the proximity sensor. People mainly get annoyed if you're just holding your phone up at a concert and recording the band. You're just looking at it through your phone, not actually taking in the full atmosphere. So that's why the team have made the app in the way they have. And you saw that that's posted to all my followers. And you can see some info there about how many people have seen me and how much time they spent watching me on Beam. And once it's posted, you can't delete it. But you can watch yourself back. So you just got to refresh by holding down. And you can see there's my name. There are two reactions. So I'm going to go ahead and look at those reactions in a minute. First I'm going to play my type of beam story, you can call it. So you just got to hold your finger down like you would on Snapchat. So I'm just going to do that for you guys. I just want to see a room tour video. If you do, just mess with because I'm recording. I'm recording a review of the beam up. You can see it's recording and the screen goes off. So you can see that showed my whole story for today. And I have got two reactions at the top here. So if you just click on the reaction button, you can see who has sent you basically a selfie of himself. Tap on the reactions. It does take a little while to load. So there is a reaction. If you want to add on Beam when you've unlocked it, just type in coffee. C-A-U-G-H-E-Y So that's one of my reactions, let's see what the other reaction is. The other reaction is from this guy. If you want to add him, his username is HunterBlood2 And that is him there. So that's the end of my reactions there, so I can just tap and it will go away. So you're probably thinking, how do I send a reaction to people? So first you want to view a Beam story. So just hold down. So you just want to move your finger around and tap the react button. That'll send a picture using your front camera to the person whose beam that is. And they'll see it as reactions like we just saw a minute ago. So I hope you enjoyed this review of beam. I'm going to give beam an 8 out of 10. Just because it's useful but it's technically a copy from Snapchat. But if you want to get a beam code just click on the interactive card in the top right now and that will take you to the Beam giveaway video so you can get onto Beam and send me reactions and follow me and I'll follow you and you can follow everybody else. Yeah, I will see you on Snapchat and on Beam guys. Bye.